Hello YouTube and welcome back to another Vacuum Mad 8 video today. And today we've got the Little and Large Show from the G-Tech. Ha ha ha. <laughs> so, today we picked these two on the 8th of October 2022 at the two boot sales in the city. These are probably going to be the two final boot sales um that are going to be available because i think generally after october most of them shut down so we picked this one up from the first car boot sale which is only about a mile or so from the house and uh, that one there is a white one which you don't, you don't see them as often as the black and the green one this is the mark one model um a bit dubious with this one here because it doesn't work at all. He said he uses it in his caravan. And it's in quite bad condition actually. There is a carrier bag over there. it. So what we'll do first is we'll have a quick look inside. And we'll see really what this thing is hiding in here. I should imagine he's just carried it over the top. Looks like it's come from the tip to be honest with you. But <laughs> God. who knows? It's a bit manky look, but as you, I think you may have known, we actually had one about a year after the, the GTX first come out. We found one by the trash. We've, done, we've never done a video of it. So we've actually got a 100% working machine. And also he's got the uh, original Moulton as well. From just from the actual one that actually come with that vacuum. Which come with the vacuum as well. So we've got both of them. So he's been laughed at this white one. There is also a pink one as well. But the white one... It's a bit more stylish. Um, they do act. I think they just introduced the white one for the Platinum Jubilee um, edition. I don't know if they're going to still call it that because obviously we lost the Queen a little while ago. Is it, no, and I think it's anti tango, if I remember correctly. Is it anti tango, is it? I think the original, the original, the new one, I think might be anti tango. Right. The new white one. So, anyway, so we've got that one. This one was £5. Um, what we're going to do, we're going to get some of them, let's see if we can ch put some charge in and we'll see if we can hear the gear on it and see if everything's working right. It's probably a bit choked up as well. At the next car boot sale, which was approximately about four miles from the first car boot sale, um, that one there, we got the highlights. Now this one, he wanted 15. I looked at it and I thought, well, let's have a look at the brush bar on it. Quite a lot of the teeth are missing on it. And I said, well... £10 he said oh yeah go on then so we got this for £10 this one does work so we pick it up here and this one they I, I think remember rightly they they had it in a drawer or something for saying how easy it was to store um, so if you look at it it is practically the same width that's the original one, look. This one has got that um, terrible system where all, it all, it just clogs the filter up on this one. And this one here is, now, Henry Quick. That's got a bag in it, look. So, that's a bag one. Nobody goes on about this bag one, do they? So this is a highlight, which is a bag. G-Tech, I think, G-Tech were the first UK company to actually introduce the bag. And I think that is actually the first one actually had a bag in it also. But this one, this bag here, to be honest with you, 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 you can, you can just do one, if you had an animal and you had, you did one room, you'd fill that bag up. It'd be really expensive to run. Um, if you look at this, the way this goes in and you look at the way that goes in, that's very similar and you just stuff the bag in it. So I think these bags are quite expensive. I think, I know what you say you were. £13 for £15. £13 for £15? £15. Yeah, 15. So the, um, the Henry Quick, I think, is available on um, the Argos website now. So you don't actually have to. So hopefully you should be able to pick it up if you really want one. So I think the Matic are doing their bags 10 to £13. But so this one is a bit of a transformer. It, it literally goes up and down like that. So you can adjust the height. You just push that. Oh. There it goes. So it is a transformer vac. The button is on. 
It would be a shame that the bottom wasn't on the top for this one, wouldn't it? Well, I suppose that's more electric. But stuff. you got the, the button to the, uh, do the handles on the top. <laughs> so yeah, this bit also at the back. Show it, show it here quickly. Shrivels. Swivels as well, like the G-Tech. So it's like, it's like a little miniature G-Tech Air Ram with a bang in it. And um, this one apparently has a, the, uh, the other motor in it. So what we'll do, just show them how that back bit goes off. Because this is the first little video, really. I'm quite yeah. So that unclips there like, like that. So you can screw that. That can actually fit into a drawer, which is a clever idea. But and you can also uh, see on the other, you can use it like that. Oh, can you? Yeah, and it's like that, and just clean the stairs like that. That's that bit there's for. Do you hold it like that, and you can. Yeah, so you can clean the stairs or your upholstery with it. It's worth pressing, probably much better than your new, normal air round because the handle doesn't come off and you have to buy a separate handle and you can't even your new ones. So what we'll do now, we'll uh, give this one a quick charge up and we'll, well actually we'll see if it works. So we'll just plug it in and see if it's charging. Yeah, just plug this one, we'll just see if the battery light comes on at all. It's plugged in. <laughs> Nothing at all. I, I, reckon it's it's, I reckon it's a duffer, but the battery is dead flat. No nights. No nothing. The advantage might is, be on. Yeah. I, I push the button. It might be on more. That's on. That's off. So what we'll do? Well, at the end of the day, we have got a complete machine. So we could just swap the battery around, take the battery to the other one, because the batteries do come out the machine. Show them how the battery comes out in one of these. Light come out. They just come out like that. So you can actually charge it. That might be better because then you know there's no power board into it. So we'll see what happens on this one. Um, it's going to take a little while to work at the on and off on this one. So yeah, so we'll be back hopefully with it on and see if it's a duffer. Well, we've just given it a quick wipe over, but on the camera it looks quite clean, but it isn't. Yeah, you can see it here a bit closer now. So we've just give this a wipe over on the outside. Um, it's taken a very, very long to charge up indeed. It's taken like, I think, um, over four hours. So, but the thing was dead flat. So if you unplug it now, and then we're gonna just give it the test to see what it's going to sound like now. Seems alright. So for £5 from the boot sale, we've got the nice white one, opposed to the, the boring grey and green one. Um, seems... I think the belt, I think it seems all right, but we're actually going to, um, the state it's in, obviously the filters need to have a good clean. It needs a really good clean and obviously some lubricants put on various parts, like on the brush, like on the brush roller and stuff like that. And yeah, so we'll do an update video with this one. Um, once it's all cleaned and fresh and we'll see how good it is against the Air Ram Highlight, which I think is a correct name for the small one. The little mini me, as they call it, or the little and large show. So yeah, the little and large show and mini me of the G-Tech Air Ram. We'll do another one. Oh, and by the way, it's Halloween. Got a treat. We've got a Halloween tree going up. So yes. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe to Vacuum Man 8. And we'll probably do an update in the next couple of weeks. Of this one here and a little like little mess around with it so we'll just have a quick look in here show you what's like inside it is a bit manky in there so yes and then down there it's a bit manky in there but everything seems to be in order i've also got a it's inside it's a new one because it says uh tap tap clean i don't think the original one that he had had that on there so yeah, so bye for now, and I'll see you again on another video. Bye.